Okay guys, so before I start this video, I have a few disclaimers for you guys. Um, obviously my intro is different. My sister and I decided to make two separate YouTube channels so that we can do our own thing. And if you want something together, we can collab. So I'll have hers linked down below and I hope you can subscribe to both of us and enjoy both our channels. Also, as you can see by the title, I went to New York City for New Year's Day. And even though I had a great time, I didn't vlog too much because after I left the Chelsea Market, it was like pitch black outside. So from there, I went to Brandy Melville. And if you continue watching the video, I will do a try on haul for you guys of all my Brandy clothes that I had bought. And I also bought new clothes today that I wanted to share and have everything linked down below as always. So I hope you continue watching and enjoy. Good morning, guys, and happy new year. So we're obviously off the train and we're currently on my favorite restaurants called Elmo. It's absolutely adorable. I'm wearing the same thing as I got last time in my vlog, but obviously once we get our food, I'll show you guys. As you can see, I really didn't have much footage in the city, but instead of just deleting it, I decided to just throw it in there. And when I went to Brandy Melville, I actually didn't see any clothes that I like really wanted because I normally like try to shop online and I saw a ton of clothes that I wanted online at Brandy that wasn't in the stores. So I ended up ordering stuff online when I got home and it arrived a couple days ago. So that's why this video kind of spans from New Year's Day to January 17th because my brand new clothes took a little while to come in, but I hope you guys like them all and I'm really excited to share them with you. So the first thing I got from Brandy are these plaid pants. Lately I've just been really trying to like change up my style because I have a lot of basics, I have a lot of sweaters, and I just feel like I'm not that super girly girl anymore wearing like sweaters and leggings and boots. Obviously I still do, but I'm trying to change things up so I got these plaid pants. They're actually navy blue, black, and green. And as you can see, they are super high-waisted and I'm really excited to wear them with the black mock neck I have on now with them and probably with the new shoes I'm about to show you guys or my white Supergas. After buying this pair of plaid pants and knowing they fit me, I'm definitely going to be buying more. So the next thing I got from Brandy was this blue shirt and you can see it has a collar and a couple of buttons and it's an unbuttoned little bit right now because that's how I wear it in the try on haul. So as you can see, it's a bit tighter and it's definitely cropped so I would pair this with a pair of boyfriend jeans I'm super excited to wear them in the summer with my high-waisted shorts from Brandy as well. It's like a cute preppy look, different than what I normally wear. So the next thing I got from Brandy was this black mock neck long sleeve. And if you remember, I actually had this on in my Christmas haul, but I was wearing my sister's. So now I finally purchased my own. And I think it's one of my favorite shirts. I've worn my sister's probably more than she's worn it so far because I've been absolutely obsessed with it. Um, mock necks have definitely been the style I like this winter. So I also got a white shirt, but I got it in a v-neck form when I actually wanted a swoop neck. So I returned it and it's being ordered. So eventually I'm sure you guys will see it in either another haul or if you follow my Instagram, which I also have linked down below for you guys, I'm sure I'll post a picture soon. So unexpectedly, me and my best friend Lexi went to the mall today. And Lexi is always my bad influence because she always finds me clothes I wouldn't normally wear or kind of just pushes me to buy something that's out of my comfort zone. So today I ended up buying three things with her and I went back to the mall and bought something else. So, the first thing I got was from PacSun. Um, it's just this cute little tank top. Obviously it's cropped. Um, I'll probably end up wearing this at school when I go out and at PacSun right now is actually having a 2 for 20 deal. So Lexi got a shirt and I got a shirt and we were bargain shoppers today. So, so I'd probably wear this how I'm wearing it right now with high-waisted black jeans and a belt or my black boyfriend jeans. So I said in my last video about a thousand times that I love pom-pom hats, but Alexi got me on my comfort zone and I got a hat that doesn't have a pom-pom. So I got this light pink Adidas hat. As you can see, it doesn't have a pom-pom, but it still has extra material up here, so it's not like flat to my head. And I feel like I'd wear this a bunch of my outfits because I'm always wearing like neutral colors, like black, gray, white, and obviously pink will go with anything like that. So I bought it today and I'm really excited to wear it. Lastly, Lexi and I went to the store called Francesca's where I knew my sister had super cute jeans, so I was gonna buy the same pair in my size. So I went and I tried them on and I ended up getting them. 
and they are high-rise straight jeans. So they kind of fit like mom jeans. As you can see, they're a bit tighter up top, but they just go straight down. And I was really excited when I found them because I didn't think they'd have my size. And online they were on sale. But what ended up happening was if you got a sale item, the next sale item was only $5. So Lexi got the same pair of jeans as well. And we each ended up spending $15 for these super cute jeans. So I was super excited. Lastly, actually, my camera's propped up in them right now. I went back to the mall with my dad because he needed new jeans and he wanted my opinion. And I've been eyeing these shoes and I just didn't want to spend the money on them because I just didn't think they were necessary at the time. But I realized I just really don't have sneakers other than the Supergas in my last video. So my father convinced me to splurge and I bought myself Nike Air Force Ones. They're the same glow and they look like this. And I'm super excited because I do not have a black shoe other than my booties that I wear all the time. But obviously this is more casual and they obviously go with so many different outfits and they're extremely comfortable so I can wear them all around campus. I'm super excited that they're leather because it's super easy to clean off, unlike my canvas shoes or my suede shoes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this random little New York City trip and clothing haul. But soon enough, I hope to make some type of routine or schedule as to what I'm going to post instead of just these random posts. And don't forget to subscribe to my sister's new channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! So as I'm editing, I'm realizing I'm sure you guys are probably thinking, Molly, why do you keep doing hauls and why do you keep buying new clothes? So actually when I got home from school, I went through all of my clothes and got rid of so many clothes between donating them and also posting them on Poshmark. So if you don't know what Poshmark is, it's a really good way to sell your clothes that either are old and you don't want anymore or are even in good condition, but you just don't like the style or that it doesn't fit you. And it's also a great way to buy clothes that are new but at a cheaper price. As you can see, my Poshmark is right here and I'll have my username linked down below for you guys. And if you want, you can check it out. So thank you again for watching.